Hello and welcome to Video Jug. We're going to make some delicious scallops with roasted tomatoes and alioli. The following recipe serves four people. Step 1. You will need the following ingredients. 16 scallops, 6 tomatoes, 8 rashers of pancetta, 1 handful of flat leaf parsley and stalks, 2 tablespoons of vegetable oil, 125 grams of rocket, 2 tablespoons of olive oil, and 1 tablespoon of sea salt. And for the alioli dressing, 1 large clove of garlic, peeled, 2 eggs, 300 ml of light olive oil, the juice of 1 lemon, 1 tablespoon of boiling water, and salt and pepper. And here are the ingredients again in a handy list. You will also need these utensils. A chopping board, a large knife, a paring knife, a large bowl, a teaspoon, a tablespoon, a frying pan, two small bowls, a roasting tin, tongs, a whisk and a measuring jug. Step 2. Preheat the oven. Firstly, preheat the oven to 230 degrees centigrade. Oh, by the way, to make roasted tomatoes is extremely time-consuming, so why don't you make a bigger batch and you can store them in a glass jar in the fridge covered with olive oil? Step 3. Core and halve the tomatoes. Using a paring knife or small knife, core the tomatoes. This simply means to cut out the eye of the tomato at the bottom and then use the large knife to halve all the tomatoes. Step 4. Prepare the baking tray. Sprinkle sea salt on the bottom of the baking tray. Then cover with parsley stalks. Layer the half tomatoes on top. Sprinkle some more sea salt over the tomatoes. Then drizzle the olive oil generously all over the tomatoes, making sure that the tomatoes are covered. Place the baking tray in the oven and cook for 10 minutes. Step 5. Turn the oven down. Now turn the oven down to 130 degrees centigrade. Step 6. Chop the garlic. Taking your clove of garlic and using the larger knife, chop the garlic very finely. Step 7. Separate the eggs. Take the two small bowls and separate the eggs. Break the shell and hold the egg over one bowl, carefully cupping the yolk in the broken shell, while letting the whites fall into the bowl. Then put the yolk into the other bowl. Step 8. Now to make the alioli. Start by putting the chopped garlic into the large bowl and the egg yolks and whisk. Now gradually add the oil, whisking continuously. It is very important to drizzle the oil in little by little or the mixture will split. Keep whisking and as it thickens add some of the lemon juice and then a little more oil. Then add a teaspoon or two of hot water to loosen it up. Repeat as necessary until all the lemon juice and oil is used. Add more hot water if necessary to loosen the mixture to the desired consistency. Now season with salt and pepper and give it a final whisk. Step 9. Clean the scallops. Clean the scallops by taking each one and removing the muscle that connects the scallop to the shell, which is at the opposite end of the tongue. Step 10. Fry the pancetta. Preheat the frying pan to a medium heat and then add the pancetta and fry for 2 to 3 minutes. 
Reserve the bacon fat to cook the scallops later on. Step 11. Season the rocket. Drizzle some olive oil over the rocket and then salt. Toss the rocket to combine it all together. Step 12. Season the scallops. Taking the bowl of scallops, pour over vegetable oil and season with salt and pepper. Then toss it all together. And after two hours, remove the tomatoes from the oven. Step 13. Fry the scallops. Take the frying pan with the bacon fat and place it on a high heat. Wait until the pan is smoking, then add the scallops, one by one. Allow them to cook for one minute. Then turn them over using the tongs and cook the other sides for a further minute. Step 14. Serve. On each serving plate, heap a mound of rocket in the centre and then place four tomato halves around the rocket. Place a scallop in between each of the tomato halves. Spoon the alioli over the rocket, tomatoes and scallops. And finally, place two rashes of pancetta on top. And there you have it. Scallops with roasted tomatoes and alioli made the video jug way.